I gotta drop my car off at the new lot. Oh, yeah. What, what, what lot's that? Jiffy Puck. Huh? It's incredible. $75 a month. 75 bucks a month? Yeah, and you get this really cool t-shirt when you sign on. <laughs> oh, I'm down. <laughs> God, you're home. I'm locked out. I dropped my car at Jiffy Park and I forgot to take my apartment key off the ring. So you got my spare? No, I gave it back to you. You did? Uh, look, can you take me over there? Oh, come on. Oh, come on, Jerry. It's all the way over to 12th Avenue. I didn't tell you to park in that lot. Now someone's got to drive you every time you need your car? What? Take the bus. I'm not going to take the bus. That's why I got a car. <laughs> Clothing salesman had a lot of nerve hitting on a lane right in front of me. He stands to make a big commission, too, on that jacket with the crest that nobody seems to like. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take that jacket back. I'm putting this guy right out of commission! All right. I'm gonna turn in. Turn in? Yeah, I had a tough day. It's only 9 o'clock. Well, you know, I don't argue with the body, Jerry. That's an argument you can't win. I can't go to sleep at 9 o'clock. Well, you can go to your room and read. <laughs> hey, look, you know, you're the one who's locked out. I'm letting you stay here. You're wearing my bathrobe. You should adapt to me. But I'm tired. Oh, why don't you go sleep at Newman's? Oh, he's got a girl up there. His quilt is too thin. No, I'm gonna get cold. I'm not even fit on this couch. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna sleep. Well, that's all I've got. Well, can I sleep with you? Huh? Oh, you got that big, uh, comfortable bed and that nice warm quilt. Kramer, there's no way you're sleeping with me. Why? Why? Yeah. Do I really have to explain why? What? Hey! Hey. What's that? Squire's walking stick. I had to write about it for the catalog. Oh, wow. You want it? Yeah. You can have it. I don't need it anymore. Oh, mama. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I am positive you are wrong about Craig. Yeah, why? Because he told a man he'd give him a discount, too. A man, Jerry. So who is he? Some friend of his from England. Don't you see? It's all a big scam. You're nuts. Well, how do you know he's not wondering the same thing about you? What do you mean? What do I mean? Well, perhaps he thinks that you're working him for the discount. Shaking that little butt of yours into big, big savings. <laughs> and then when you get it, you know, you drop him like a hot potato. Oh, please. No, see, the two of you need to work on trust. And then, and only then, will there be a free exchange of sex and discounts. <laughs> the cornerstones of a healthy relationship. And now, if you would excuse us, we need to get to bed. Furniture's on sale. <laughs>